How's it going, guys? It's Joe the Chocobo, and I am back, and I'm playing some Titanfall. And so today, what we're going to be doing is going to try to be mixing up the channel a little bit. We're going to try to go for it, and I say try because it is going to be trying. I can't guarantee this will actually go through all the time, but we're going to try to do two vids a day, one of which will be COD, some form of COD, and the other one will be um, another game, another shooter game. Because I think it's going to be something nice to do just to mix it up. Because it has been a long time and just playing a lot of COD. Uh, so, playing Titanfall today, obviously. And, uh, you know, this is a game that was a fair bit of fun. I don't usually like playing alone. It seems like the multiplayer has calmed down a bit. So people are just kind of having a little bit more fun with it. Uh, which means it's a lot more fun in turn to play. And there, there are still some, like, really try-hard groups that are running around, but there's a lot more just kind of, like, random parties and stuff. They'll still try to work together, but it's not quite as frustrating as walking into a group of, like, eight titans who are all like, What's up, bro? We've been, uh, we've been waiting and expecting for you. No, it's just, ugh, it's annoying. But anyways, I also wanted to try and do, like, a topic commentary type thing. And one topic that was recommended... Your mission is to eliminate enemy forces interfering with the search. In position. Pilots prepare to disembark. <laughs> Sorry. I, I feel really rude if I talk when something else or someone else is talking. But anyways, um, yeah. One topic that was recommended to me was talking about back to school. And some people were asking, hey, Choco, you know, how did you go through, like... Um, school times, like, was it awkward? Like, how, like, how did you manage to, um, like, kind of handle the pressure and whatever else of everything that's going on? And I think that's a fantastic question. So, I was sitting there thinking to myself, like, well, you know, what really made high school, um, for me, a lot more enjoyable and just something that was a lot of fun? And in general, I think what it was was... If, if you keep busy in high school, I think you'll generally find that things go pretty well. Um, if you don't keep busy, then it just kind of becomes weird and like you, you can you get distracted more easily by what's going on around you even if you shouldn't be. All right, let's just drop that guy. Oh, oh, I forgot there's cloaking. I don't know how I forgot there was cloaking, but yeah, that was not smart on my part. All right. Take out that one, and we still have this Titan running around. Alright, there's another one. Oh, it's a grunt. Darn it, grunt. I do not wish to kill you. I wish to kill your leaders. Ah! No, no. Ooh. Wait, what? Alright. And, yeah, but, um, so basically for high school and stuff like that, even, even I guess if you were younger than that or whatever else, but, um, generally speaking, what's always done well by me is just kind of keeping busy, keeping, keeping active in whatever you're doing at school. And I think just in general, like, even if you, even if I was having a bad day, just because I kept busy, um, it did help a little bit with everything. And... Woo! So, like, whenever I was in high school, I remember I picked up, uh, in my, what, in my freshman year, I picked up some stuff, like, I picked up uh, activities like, um, I picked up stuff like I was playing, I played, well, okay, in my freshman year, I played, uh, some instruments, and so some of my friends, uh, that I knew of had, you know, joined the marching bands. I was, yes, I was a band geek. And it was totally awesome. And we got to run around and woohoo! Hello, friend! That was really weird. Alright, um. Wait, oh, no! 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 I didn't want to go out this way. Wow, that is a long ways away to be shot from. Kidding? That's crazy how far away that guy just shot me from. The smart pistol? Dang. Alright, let's see here. So many grunts! So many grunts! Oh no! No, baby, no! Oh, gal, that is... That was awkward. But yeah, so in my freshman year, I just kind of did that. I also joined, like, the speech and debate team, and just I just basically kept really, really busy. Um, 
and I thought it was a lot of fun. I thought it was it was a tre tremendous amount of fun, a tremendous amount of like fun activities going on, and I really enjoyed doing that. So, um, we but granted there were some like cool things about the way that the school I went to, how they did marching band. Like we would go on trips and stuff. We got to go to Disney um, to march in a parade, which was pretty sick. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it was pretty awesome. But at the same time, you know, it's it's something that also was just it kept my mind off things and. I got really, really happy whenever I got to accomplish stuff, which, you know, I think people are always kind of inherently goal-oriented, goal so whenever you work towards a goal and you get closer, I think everyone just generally enjoys it. Um, gamers especially so, because everyone that games generally is working towards some goal. Like, even if you're playing Harvest Moon, or like, if you're playing, like, Hello Kitty Online Adventures, like, you, you always are working towards something as a gamer, and I think that whenever you take that... Ooh. Ooh, I suck at aiming. Thank you for whatever fail parkouring. I don't even know what you were doing. All right, but yeah. So um. Ooh, did I just watch. Huh. Okay. Well, we're getting wrecked team-wise. That's not good. But yeah. Um, it was. I think being school-oriented in general, and if you're a gamer, you probably are. It's always something good to have an active thing that you're working towards. Even even if it's not like something super serious, like even if you wanted to join like some kind of like random club at your school, or um, if you even just wanted to kind of get together with some friends and just make kind of like a tradition of doing something, I think that's always a fun thing. Oh, but yeah, that's I mean that was what I did in freshman a year, and I think later on um, I got to also do some really cool stuff, aka. What I by by, yeah by the end of things I was kind of really, I had, I actually changed schools in high school, which was a huge bummer for me because you know I had kind of I kind of had like you know my whole life, um, kind of planned out for the school I was at for my fresh like since my freshman year and I was like oh you know I'm going to be here and it's going to be awesome, uh, but then you know obviously it switched up but I got to I got to pick up, um, what I picked up two sports. And I also tried training slash managing for a year, which was kind of strange. But in general, I always kept busy. And I think keeping busy was just a great way to kind of have fun and still, uh, yeah, just kind of have fun and keep your mind off things. And in general, it, it either made you take your focus off of the bad things or it would um, get you like really pumped up because you're working towards that goal and you're um, working towards things, which I thought was pretty cool. But yeah, there's that. And of course, if you if you ever feel like you're just like really awkward around people, I can't I can't pretend to like really understand that too much because I didn't really have so much of that problem. But if you ever feel like you're just awkward around other people and you're just like, ah, oh, you know what? I just you know I, I'm I feel so weird just like approaching people and trying to make new friends. You know what? If you if you never try, how would you know? How would you know if maybe that person could be your new best friend um, that you just never had the opportunity previously to talk to? And it doesn't have to be like this perfect conversation. It can just be something stupid. It can be something silly. I don't think anyone's gonna ever be upset with you. Be like, how dare you speak to me? Especially speak to you that way if they are anyone worth knowing. So, um, ooh, oh, I tagged him. Ooh, right in midair. Alright, let me see here. Ooh. Ooh, God! And out I go. And boom. Alright. Let's just drop that guy. Alright, there goes that guy. Oh, no! Elizabeth, a fan! Alright, thank you. Woo! But yeah, other than that, I mean, if you if you're, if you're you just started off your uh, freshman year of high school, um, I would definitely consider also, like, if you just started up anywhere, 
I guess this applies even to college if you really want to, or maybe even middle school. I'm not really sure about middle school, though. Middle school's kind of pushing it, but if, you, if you're just starting out something, and you're just like, oh, you know what, I'm just getting into things, I'm in a new place, or like I'm trying to kind of turn over a new page in my life, definitely definitely always look for something new to do because if you have like a goal to work towards it also has the added benefit and maybe this is the more important part is that you make new friends you meet new people um and the cool thing is if it's something that you love doing then it's you're going to be actually working towards something with other people that like it too right they, they want to also get this done oh dang move oh <laughs> Oh man, I don't know if this thing's gonna last. Get to the chopper! Oh, yes! Go! 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 Did we make it? I think we made it. Oh yeah. But yeah, I'm sorry this commentary was very like <laughs> segmented and disorienting and strange. It was just like really weird. <laughs> but yeah, um, that's that's my opinion and my kind of out my outlook my point of view for kind of how to approach kind of the start of the new year for classes whichever level you're taking classes at and stuff like that and yeah stay stay strong and just kind of you know keep on keep on trying to take things in kind of a more positive happy way it just makes things better i think um, but yeah if you did enjoy this be sure to hit that like button comment down below if you enjoyed titanfall um, I know that my commentary was not exactly on point and it was kind of all over the place, but um, I'll, I'll work to get that better. I'm also a little bit loopy at the moment because two squirrels have been like harassing me all day. It just if you if you don't know what I'm talking about, ask people on Twitter. It, it's just it, it's it's a tough life. Um, but yeah, uh, make sure to comment down below kind of how you feel about Titanfall, and of course subscribe to the channel if you're new. If you like to see more shooter content and stuff like that. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!